Hello, everybody, and welcome back. We're about to see Weekly get his face beat in by a big, strong bull man. Moose. I'll go back and. No, he's an ox. He? Right, right. So I'm thinking. Who goes first? Am I playing as him? Yeah. Uh. Uh. Helen. Here's one for Helen. Uh, how much does Champs ever fear that boxing will take a toll on him? Uh, are the rumors about you and a weary? Troop, how much uh, does Champies pay you? I'm curious. Can you tell us how much Champies pays you to endorse them? Sure, honey. They pay me much more than I'd ask them for. In fact, Champies is so delightfully delicious that I'd even do it for free. Ah. Does that answer your question? Uh, no. No. Nonsense. We both know it does. Okay, cool. Okay, now. Thanks. Uh, uh Al. Here's a question for Al. Are you ever jealous about sharing your sweetheart with America? Any thoughts on your upcoming fight against Yale? Uh, what do you think about needing a manager? What do you think about Yale? Yeah. In just 12 days, the contender will try to steal your belt. Any thoughts on your fight against Yale? Uh, yeah, sure. My Al is going to kick that thug's behind. Isn't that so, honey? Yeah, well, we'll see. No such thing as a weak rival. I did not Nonsense. expect him to be Hispanic. You are and will yeah. Be I, I honest champion. to God did not. Next question. <laughs> okay. Moving on. Uh, take a picture so they don't get suspicious. How should we pose? Uh, uh lovebirds. Yay, lovebirds. Okay, how about a hug? I want to feel the love. Uh, In the image. Okay. You're the envy of all America. Now what? Okay, uh, so I uh, ask Helen because I just asked okay, Al. Okay, Helen. Uh, did you ever feel that boxing will take a toll? I think it's already Dating there. Dating a boxer a bit. can be dangerous. Aren't you afraid that those blows to the head will take a toll on his intellectual capacity? Honey. Take a look at my man, and then I married him for his body. You really think I'm with him because of his <laughs> intellectual capacity? Oh my god! <laughs> Write this down. Nothing will change my man. His smarts, manliness, and integrity are all boxing proof. Um. Okay, one more question, and oh, it's a leery. No, it's no, Cassidy. It's Cassidy. Can you answer it? I've got to go say hi to a fan. <laughs> Wait, is she in on this? I'll be right back, Mr. Pulitzer. Uh, <laughs> Pow! You mean she stopped smiling when that fan showed up? Uh, yeah. Could you describe him for me? I'll be able to show you something as soon as I'm done developing these pictures. So you took a and picture actually, of him? I thought it was odd, too. So while I continue to interview Stone, I managed to take some pictures of Moore and whoever her mysterious fan was. Hey, there we go. Hey, it's gonna be Mitchell. I'm I don't guessing know, they look, it looks so, like Cassidy, uh, but he we? would know who That's Cassidy is. Uh, you ever feel jealous? Yeah. Any thoughts? Uh, what do you feel about needing a manager? Yeah. Manager? Yeah, what do you think about feeling a new manager to compete? Your manager is Frank Cassidy, president of the Boxing Managers Association of New York. According to him, only boxers working with member managers should be allowed to compete. What do you think about that? Cassidy is a great manager, really. No complaints there. And the work he's putting in as president of the association is really valuable. But, I don't know, maybe in this case, Joe Dunn was right. Wait, no. Could you keep that last comment uh, off the record? You know, on the down low. My lips are sealed. On the wait, why was that censored? I'm an Let's asshole. I don't too. fucking know. Uh, uh show me your back. Turn around and show me those biceps from behind. Like that? That's it. Am I okay, I thought that was my chance yeah. to uh Wait, I, I accidentally moved. Stand still, I'll take another one. Ah. What's with me today? Don't move, please. So now I need to... Get it. There we go. Now we got it. Should we keep at it? 
Let's see. Do you ever feel jealous about sharing dating with America's Are sweetheart? Are you ever jealous about sharing your sweetheart with America? Well, uh, I wouldn't say I'm jealous, but I know that someone so popular and honest can draw the wrong kind of attention. There are That's plenty true. of people who would love to put an end to our career, so it's not easy. Hi, Luna. Uh, take a picture, because I already did the, the Yale one. I'm going to take one more, all right? Uh, it. Eyes closed. Chin on your fist. Let's see what you think about this. Close your eyes and rest your chin on your fist. The boxing thinker. Like these? Exactly. A little lower. Yeah, I was right. Yep, What's there it is. Me? Stand still. I'll take it again. Okay. Lizard! Yeah. It is him! I can't seem to get it right. Don't move. So it is Mitchell. He is behind all this shit. Where the fuck? Let me take the picture. Yeah, you have it there. It's about okay. time. There we go. Finally. We're all set. Okay, so I don't have a picture of his face, but come on, that was obviously a wizard with his yeah. lizard mouth Wait, and his lizard so fingers. Are you telling me the photos are developed? Or is that what you said <laughs> to Stone? Both. Just look. Aha! Look at his hand. Is he pulling something out of Moore's purse? Or putting it in? He's the drugs... The the medicine that Bobby was being put on. He's running a an athletic drug ring. Hold up. Card. Steroids? Yeah, there we go. August. August Merrick. Merrick. Okay, cool. He looks like a good boy. <laughs> okay. Uh... Who's that guy? I know he's not a fan. You should have seen her face when she saw. I him. mean, she doesn't look happy right there. Obviously. Okay, you know what? What is, what is this? How much do you think each bicep weighs? More a than lot. your entire body. <laughs> less than your tongue. Jesus. <laughs> You're hilarious. All right, where is he? All right, that's ah. him there. I think she only smokes when she's nervous. What was making her nervous? Oh, sh I think he wanted to the boxing put Al on the pills. The boxing poet. Mm. Boxing just might turn out to be the intellectual I think that is choice. what's going on. He's got some kind of athlete, athlete steroid ring going. Can't you just see the love? I'm not so sure, to be honest. Love is not subservience. Hmm. Oh, we can go down here. It's... Uh, okay. Uh, well, that's yeah, a decent one. picture. But it doesn't tell the truth. Huh? Of course it's the truth. I was there. Stone isn't as strong as he looks, and Moore certainly doesn't need him to lift her up. Interesting. Oh, he missed the picture, I guess. Is he pulling something out of Moore's purse? Uh, what am I looking in? for right now? Because we did uh, all of these. The yeah, there's one more. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Hmm. It's Mitchell. It's fucking yep. Mitchell. Yeah, Wait, la, the, wanna... the Lizard Lounge. Yeah. I've seen that matchbox before. El Iguana. La Iguana. La Iguana. F female. Yes. That one. I forget what it's thingy. You know. It's Wait, just La Iguana. That's him. There is no he, masculine he, version he, of it. The surgeon. Oh. Seriously? There is no <laughs> El Iguano. <laughs> Not yet. Right. El Iguano. We still have to find him. Uh, it's great. just La Iguana. Hey, pal. Did you hear what I just said? We need to keep looking at all those pictures. We need a clue that will take us it. to Mitchell. Hey, see? There. Just like I was saying. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Weekly. We need a clue that can get us there. Oh, you look, know, a clue. Let's go, oh, yeah, like that one. Wait a minute. <laughs> so I knew we were going to go to this fucking place. They don't just throw that kind of shit around for nothing. It's, you know, it's like Chekhov's gun. You have it mm -hmm. there for a reason. You don't just not use it. Although, how much do you want to bet that if we were failing this case, we'd probably be like, oh, I don't know what, where we go. Blah, blah, blah. There's probably some version where you don't go to this place. I feel like I feel like we've been doing okay on this case. Yeah. God, this place looks seedy. Brawls aren't even the worst part of my job. It's the sure. acting? 
You may take a beating, but at least you get the chance to defend yourself. But when you're sitting in your car all night, there's no way out. Oh, boredom. Got it. I'll just have to send in your legs weekly. Cramp up, your back and neck oh, feel no. stiff. Your entire body aches. I mean, he does know else. what you look like. It's just boring. get out and do some stretches. And repetitive. Who the fuck's gonna see you out here? Although I guess There's seeing a cat doing by. jumping jacks would be kind of weird. Yeah, outside of a bar. Instead of going in. <sighs> Why are we just waiting out here again? People were he doesn't know what you look like. Oh! Was about to close. We're waiting for it to close. Okay. Maybe Mitchell is... Tool special hmm. Maybe Mitchell is the owner's dad or something? I had no choice. I don't know. This is very strange. It's like discovering a secret kingpin. I mean, but... wouldn't be surprised, honestly. Hmm. Oh, it's this dude again. Oh, he's definitely going to recognize us, though. I see you took me up on my invitation. Lost my hat, though. You knew not to come until my anti fur regulars had all cleared out. I can't say no to good advice. It's right, a moment to actually remember shit, the uh, thing. We're doing this again. Fantastic. He poured that really high up. Oh, we just drank it. Okay. He's looking at you, Mr. Farnham. What was your name? As far as I knew, La Iguana always stayed neutral. He played poker. <laughs> tight. Cassidy, but his joint was used as the gambling drop off for O'Leary's operation. Did it make sense to keep faking it? Or was it too dangerous not to? I think we should keep... F w uh, yeah! yeah! Blackmore. John H. Blackmore. I knew it. Although you texted Okay, good. He, he was already Let's in on say, it. I represent certain sports lobbies I'd rather not talk about. I understand. My pleasure, Mr. Blackmore. Okay, take a calculated risk. So he already knew... Yeah. So if we'd kept lying to him, he would have felt insulted that or something. That sure beats your poker game. This is oh. much easier. <laughs> no one can cheat. I don't know. <laughs> you barely flinched when Cassidy decided to teach that ego a lesson. Mm. What do you want me to say? Uh... This is my first time. Between you and me, it's not the first time I find myself in this situation. Who doesn't have their own barber with a license to kill? <laughs> Damn it. Well, nobody's perfect. Tell me, what do you really want with Cassidy? <clears throat> I just don't understand your motives. You're just scouting out talent. You know how a scout goes out to Little League games in search of young talent? Well, that's what I was doing at your poker game. But it's too soon to tell. Don't worry about it. I was only curious. So, what about me? What do you want What about you? He is about to swing no that at me. No one comes to like one not just to drink and play pool. That's a I'm shame. I'm looking for one of your regulars. Dr. Angus Mitchell. What for? Uh, cops trying to tell if we fought together during the war. Yes! We fought together during the war. I just want to say hi. Sure. Tell you what, I'll talk to Mitchell. Come back tomorrow night. I fucked that up, didn't I? You don't understand. I have to talk to him, or else. Or else what? You're pretty bad, Del Cassie. Fuck. I don't have the money. Oh, I do have money. Yeah, we do. Oh, should I try to pay him off? Yeah. If you want to, it probably, it probably would work, but threatening him I don't think is going to be a good idea. Alright, money. You'd be losing your chance to make a pretty penny. I know how to reward my allies. You think I'd spend my time in this dump if all I cared about was the money? Please, cut the crap. Anything else? Shit. Okay. <sighs> eh. He already knows it's... the Cassidy works. I guess threaten him? Yeah. Oh, God, this is gonna suck. Uh, I've got friends in high places. 
friends you don't want to meet. Oh, you don't think I do? You think this dump would still be open otherwise? Please, cut the crap. I hate to say this, but you're running out of options. Yeah, I should just... Okay. Cassidy. I don't think Cassidy would be too happy about the role his poker buddy plays in O'Leary's gambling operation. I'm sure you understand that. I Son did fucking bitch. every option. <laughs> All right. Give me your phone number, and I'll give you a call when Mitchell shows up. No. You're going to call him right now, and you're going to give him this message. Okay, here we go. Well, We're finally going to catch your car all night. There's no way out. Your legs cramp up. Your back and neck feel stiff. Ha ha, I've got you now. To be somewhere else. It's boring and repetitive. Until so, so bad, you just went back into your car to wait. Loop. Like when you're stuck in your car on surveillance duty. So now we're going to tail him. The owner of La Iguana was supposed to tell Mitchell that a certain anteater was still alive. And that it was only a matter of time before he ratted him out. So we do have With our a guy. Bit of luck, that would make him nervous enough to nice. lose his hand. Now all I had to do... Oh my god, who's that fight. phantom figure? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, things are finally starting to turn around for us. Hopefully, unless this is all a big misunderstanding, which I hope yeah. it's not. Hopefully we just have our guy. Otherwise this is going to suck. Because we're kind of threatening an old man. Unless he's, you know, the steroid kingpin guy. He, I would be surprised if he is. He quite possibly is. He has like the background. Cassidy record. wanting to ensure that Alstone wins. I is it is it he, is Cassidy even attempt? Uh, I words. I don't know. Is Cassidy even tied to this? He could just be sitting on the sidelines enjoying the fucking chaos. Where the hell are we? Are we at the docks? Uh. No, we're at the right. train yard. Where the fuck are we? I think yeah we're at the docks. Oh, here. with pier. Okay, we are at the docks. Oh, thunder! We were tailing you with our lights on the entire time. <laughs> we are at the peak of stealth, as you know. Big old <laughs> boat. Put so... on the stealth lights, you know. <laughs> Uh, it's, it's oh, camo high by, uh, beams. You know, it's like the GTA stealth missions. Oh, it's a, it, it, you gotta stay as close as possible because that's not suspicious as all at all. Hmm, got you now. So all those other clues were either things we failed or they were just red herrings. Cause I think we got you, motherfucker. <laughs> It's, he doesn't have fucking armed guards out here. Just go. Unless he does have armed guards, and then ooh. Ah, he got the briefcase. Wait, was he the sniper? Oh no. Oh, it's the Push other man. dude. It's and the it's other guy who attacked me with the same guy. Like the uh, so it same was gang. Him. Sound. Like the thing you could looking at is probably. Yeah. Done. Horse is standing guard at the warehouse is armed. Yes, that's Brad. That I can probably a... see the key on uh, the guy's belt. Oh, yeah. And also his jacket. It's definitely going to be a tell. Uh, the guys who are uh, ganged up on you. Oh, it's a briefcase. He went in without it. I wonder what's in it. Sniper. Yeah, his jacket. Hell's, Hell's horses. horses. Interesting. That's a lot of bombs there. Okay, we can probably hear what they're saying. Maybe. Yes. Okay, we got the conversation. We'll be just fine. Don't worry. Gil, stand guard right here. If the cat shows up, you know what to do. Okay, so they know about me. I'll How be flattering. Back in an hour. 
Oh, that's great. Ah, God. Let me just... There we go, hit that. Okay, so he's got orders to kill us. That's gonna go great. Actually, we should probably pause here again. Yeah, you probably have a chance to do something here. Boom. Okay, good. Alright, you can pause between things. Yeah, alright, so that's good. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you later. Adios.